Six months ago today, South Dakota Attorney General Jason Roundsburg hit and killed Joe Beaver with his car near the community of Highmore. The Attorney General not present for his initial court hearing today for charges stemming from what happened that night. It is 5.30 and good evening everyone. I'm Brian Allen. Thank you for joining us. I'm Sam Wright. That initial hearing happening in Hughes County just about an hour ago. Roundsburg was not at that hearing, but his attorney entered three not guilty pleas on his behalf. Taking a closer look here, Roundsburg is facing three criminal charges, those being operating a motor vehicle while using an electronic device, driving outside of his lane, and careless driving. None of those charges hold Roundsburg criminally responsible for Beaver's death. Austin Goss was in the courtroom for today's hearing. Let's get to him live and peer to continue our coverage here at 530. Austin. Good evening, Brian and Sam. Tim Wrench, Roundsburg's attorney, said that there were mountains of evidence to review in this case and that it would take a lot of time to do so. That means that we may not hear more about this case until mid-May. Although Roundsburg himself was not in attendance, a large portion of the Beaver family was, including Joe's widow, Jenny. The prosecutor, Emily Savell and Michael Moore, did not object to Roundsburg's two-month request. I spoke with Beaver's cousin, Nick Nemec, shortly after the hearing. Unfortunate that it drags on and drags on. Uh, I've, I've made a vow I'm going to show up every time we, I have to. It's not going to take a very deep dig into the mountain to, to prove him guilty of these three misdemeanor charges. Now, Nick also said that he was not surprised by, Round, by Roundsburg's pleas, but he was disappointed and that there was much, much evidence against Roundsburg. Live in Pier, Austin Goss, Dakota News Now. Austin, thank you. The widow of Joe Beaver has previously stated that she plans to file a civil lawsuit against Attorney General Roundsburg. 